Philip Payne. Let me move this shit out of the way so you guys can see me. As you see, I still wear my mask. Not because of the pandemic, because that shit just make me look better. <laughs> y'all laughing, that shit make some of y'all look better too. <laughs> Let's get something out the way. Hello, white people. Hi. Oh my God, this room screams white privilege. <laughs> Last time I stood in front of this many white people, the event ended with, will the defendant please stand? <laughs> I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. I like talking about white people. I travel a lot. I just came back from Sweden. That's where they make white people. I saw the factory. That shit is called Ikea. But you know, I feel like every black man should have at least two white friends. One for a friend, one for an alibi. I got three, I keep a spade. But you know, I'm changing some shit. My lawyer got me on a new weight loss program. It's called divorce. <laughs> I've lost 195 pounds in three months. That shit is amazing to me. But as you see, I'm a double minority. I'm fat and I'm black. A lot of my friends don't like it when I say that shit. They be like, Phil, you can do something to fix one of them. Now how the hell I'm gonna stop being black? No bullshit, but I'm a big guy. And being a big guy, I do big guy shit. Like I never met a male I didn't like. I took a young lady out to dinner. She asked me if I wanted to share a meal. Do I really look like I ever shared a meal? No bullshit. But I'm doing better now. I'm seeing the nutritionist. She got me working on my eating habits. She got me watching who I eat now. I don't eat anything white. So I'm strictly black people meat. But you know it's all good. Relationships are hell. I used to date a midget chick. It was a real short relationship. I had to break up with her ass and I felt real bad about it because she really looked up to me. I got relationship issues. For some reason my wife and my girlfriend don't get along at all. I ran to my wife at the movies with another guy. And I was hurt and I really didn't know what to say. I looked at my girlfriend she said I probably shouldn't say shit. Relationships are hell. But it's all good. But like I said, you know, I'm a big guy. I went to the doctor. The doctor said, you are what you eat. So I'm changing my name to Tracy now. <laughs> the doctor told me I need to get down to 185 pounds. I'm like, how the hell I'm gonna do that? Shit, that's my birth weight. <laughs> my kid, it's crazy. Any of y'all got any kids in here? Y'all like your kids? I hate my damn kids. My kid's bad as shit. I got a 13 year old who cuss like a sailor. I don't know where the hell he got that shit from. <laughs> My son told me he was gonna run away from home. I said, why run when I can drive your ass? I just don't get it, kids are bad. But it's all good. My son told me every time you turn around, you're getting into shit. But I told his ass, well you need to stop turning around. You know, my son is at the age that we can talk about shit. Like, I bought my son some condoms. And I explained to his ass, if my father had done this shit for me, we wouldn't be having this conversation. It's crazy. You know, kids are crazy, man, but it's all good. It's all good. But like I said, you know, I used to have a drinking problem. I found that this shit was starting to interfere with my drug problem. I used to smoke a lot of weed. I still can't remember why I stopped. No shit. But I got questions. Like, what the hell are edibles? Exactly how much weed do you have to smoke before you decide to eat your weed? Like, that, shit, that shit is real. I just don't understand it. I'm getting older now. I remember when I was young, I used to date cougars. Now that I'm getting older, I'm dating mountain lions. She introduced me to her friends. Lions, tigers, and bears. I said, oh my. You know, took this chick on a date. We sitting in the club doing date shit. I'm sitting there looking in her eyes. She's sitting there looking at mine. I'm sitting there checking out her titties. She's sitting there checking out mine. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's it, I'm good. Thank you. Give it going for Philip, everybody. Yes. And his titties. Yes. All right, next comment.